Yo, what's going on, guys? I'm gonna show you how to get increased FPS in Arsenal, and this will work in any Roblox game. So it's not just Arsenal. Uh, you can do this in any game. But uh, yeah, let's get into the video. So if you ever played Roblox, you're gonna have this Roblox icon on your desktop, and uh, to do this, just follow these steps. You can slow down the video and look at it if you're not as good with this, but just follow my steps I do here. All right. So right click on the Roblox icon and go to the bottom and click properties. Now go here and press open file location. Now go to platform contents, PC, and then now this is the page where we're going to have the most steps to do. So it should say fonts, terrain, and textures. If it says this, you're on the right page. What I want you to do is grab textures and drag it to the desktop. Once you've done that, it should say in here, it should just say fonts and terrain. Once you've done that, now we can join a Roblox game and see how it looks. And voila, here we go. Now the game obviously does not look as good as it did before, but um, you're going to get a lot more FPS. If you see in the top there, I'm getting about 130 to 160 FPS, which is very good. Uh, now, some of you, not, not many of you, this is a very rare problem, but some of you are going to have a problem where the skies are going to be black. So stick around in the end of the video, and I'm going to show you how to fix that. But you first run the game, and if your graphics aren't high, uh, it's going to look really bright. And to be honest, it doesn't look as good. It kind of hurts my eyes. So I would definitely recommend putting your graphics on low for this. You'll get more FPS, plus the game will look better. I know it look better on worse graphics. kind of weird. But yeah, and the game doesn't look too bad. It's definitely a lot more playable. It, like, it doesn't affect the way you play the game. It probably makes you a bit better even though my aim is not really that good. But uh, yeah, now let's get into how to fix the problem if the skies are black for you. This did happen at first when I first tried this a few days ago. So yeah, let's, let's, uh, let's get into fixing that problem. Okay, now if you have the black sky problem, follow these steps. It's not that difficult. It looks difficult, but let's just, you know, let's just do it. So you got to create a new file and you can, you can name it whatever you want. I'm just going to name it. I'm going to name it sky just because uh, that's what's what it is. So now go back to your textures, uh, your textures file that you had on your desktop and double click it. And it should say sky down here. Now just copy this file. Don't delete it. If you delete it, you're going to be messed up. Just make sure you copy it, control C or copy it and go back to here and we go to sky and then we paste it into here. And there we go. Now it's going to look the same for me if I join back in a game, but if your sky was black before and you join back, it's now going to look exactly like how it looked before. So I hope this did help you guys with this, uh, with this problem if you have been getting less FPS. Now, if you want to get over 60 FPS, you're going to need an FPS unlocker, which is just look up FPS unlocker on Google and you'll find it. But, uh, yeah, if not, you, if you have pretty much any PC, you should be getting 60, which is, uh, which is very good. It's all you really need for Roblox. And, uh, yeah. I'm not very good at this game, but uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Um, subscribe, like if you're new, if you uh, did enjoy the content or you this helped you out at all. And uh, yeah, thank you and see you guys.